Virginia Kaya left a lucrative career in banking to pursue farming at Red Hill in Kiambu. Before I entered into farming, I had worked with the Central Bank of Kenya for 20 years. For the 20 years, 17 of them, I had been uh, working at Mombasa. And uh, we came from Mombasa, set a home, now in our rural home, which is Red Hill. And uh, that was when I realized that I could do something. Virginia is among medium to large scale farmers selected to join a program aimed at introducing farming as a business for food security in Kenya. The project funded by the Dutch government in collaboration with Equity Bank involves training farmers on how to expand production on underutilized land and increase yields through the use of technology, equipment and value addition. They have a passion for farming. So when I do it right, I'm very happy. Virginia started out by growing maize and beans, as is common among farmers in the area. I was mainly uh, selling uh, the maize and the beans to people who are coming here. And again, such crops are very seasonal because uh, you don't grow them throughout the year. But uh, when I got training from uh, Equity Group and started doing the, the vegetables, I realized I could do my sales on a daily basis. After training, she ventured into quick maturing of horticultural crops whose demand in the nearby city of Nairobi is insatiable. I'm basically dealing with uh, horticulture. Uh, that is uh, spinach, sukumawiti or kale, managu, amaranth. After I got the training from Equity Group Foundation, I am now making about between 200,000 and 300,000 a month. The money I'm making from what I'm growing also makes me happy. I mean, it motivates me to wake up and to go and work. Virginia has improved her cultivation by utilizing the training she received on drip irrigation that ensures that she has produce all year round come rain or drought. Drip irrigation has made a very big, a very big difference in my yield because during the hot season, I've realized it's very easy to farm when you have the drip irrigation because you only need very little water. Income from the farming as a business has prompted her to double the farm under crops to eight acres with the aim of expanding her reach to international markets. My number one plan for, the, for my future growth is to do total drip irrigation. Number two is to increase the area I'm, do I'm doing currently. Right now I'm doing about four acres, but uh, I plan to do about eight acres in the future. I even plan to do exportation in the future.